Hello guys. Hello indeed. How is it going here? It's all going bad. It's all going bad. Hey guys, live on the Archie Luxury channel. We are broadcasting now. We are broadcasting now and I'm very happy to have you guys on the channel, the YouTubes. I do the tubers, the tubers. I do the tubers. And uh, I got to tell you, man, I got to tell you, I've been watching some interesting docudramas last night. And I want to ask you, I was watching a very interesting thing about Japan. I love Japan. And there's people who are old, <coughs> who they are lonely men who've been disenfranchised by the family. They went off to work 30 years ago. Now they just live by themselves. The family, when they do die, the only reason uh, they get discovered is the neighbours complain about the stink coming from their apartment. And once they die, they depart. Uh, you know what happens, don't you? You know what happens, don't you? I can tell you exactly what happens. It's not friendly. Uh, the relatives, they don't want to, they deny the inheritance, often because they'll have to pay taxes. They don't want the, so all the possessions, they ring a company up who comes and takes all their shit away uh, for recycling, um, for, for anything they can. Um, it's very sad. It's sad. It's sad. So the question is, what happens when, when, when we die in the West? What the fuck is going to happen to all your possessions what are you going to do with all these fucking things what's going to happen man what's going to happen uh that's what i want to ask you what is going to happen the rolex bubble has not burst clive clivers reports i've got a very special he's given me permission to put on my channel here Clivers is going to report on the fact that the bubble bubble has not burst. That's correct. It hasn't happened, fuckers. No Rolexes were damaged in this interview. That's correct, guys. No Rolex, please. Rolex, please. No Rolex, please. No Rolexes were damaged in the making of this video. That is correct. That is correct. Rolex or bust. That is so correct there, man. It is very, very true. This is what happens, man. It's what you call, it's what you call, it's the, it's the hyperinflationary times we live in. It's Lolex, please. So I got to tell you, man, I got to tell you, I've seen the light. It's all fuck this fuck. Die to be completely fucked. To be completely fucked. That's what it is, man. It's it's absolutely uh fuck this fuck die. That's the way it is, man. I'm telling you now, man. I'm telling you how it is. Now we got some super chats. I de desperately need the super chats tonight. Absolutely. Blue shirt butter. $1.99. It's Saturday night. Live with the pontiff. And tonight, guys, it's my scotch night. This is the once a week I get to drink and have a scotch. Stop, watch, and roll. $2. Wishing you a wonderful trip in Singapore. $2. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, what else is going on? Let me tell you now, man. I can tell you this now. It is all very, very nasty stuff. It is very fucking hard. It's very hard. Really, 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 really hard. That's the way it is, man. It's very hard. Um, this is how it is, man. It's fucked. Yankee Doodle. Yankee Doodle Dandy. Yankee Doodle Dandy. Yankee Doodle Dandy. It's a Yankee Doodle Dandy. Yankee Doodle. Yankee Doodle. I love the Yankee Doodle. I got to tell you, man, it's very fucking hard doing this YouTube thing. It's very hard. Uh, it, it's difficult. It's always difficult. It's hard. It's 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 not easy. It's 
are nasty. It's just the way we roll. The punches we roll with, it's tough. It's vicious. It's everything you could possibly think that could go wrong in the YouTube space. That is what my life is like there, man. It's very, very, very hard. Very, very hard indeed there. So got to tell you, man, um, talking about Japan, I watched a docudrama about people living in Japan cyber cafes. Is this something you'd consider? I actually love, I did see that docudrama. I love all things Japanese. Uh, look, I tell you what, it's cheap. You, you're in a seat. There's food and cooking prepared. You basically, gamers do that. And you can also, you can live permanently in these internet cafes. You betcha. You betcha. I honestly can't think of a better way to spend time in Japan. How hard is it, Steve Camasso? Two dollars. It's Lily hard. It's really hard. And I'm just trying to get the, the clivers on the channel now. We get the clivers on here because we want the clivers on my channel. Uh, just let me get this group happening here. Come on the channel, fucker Roonies. <laughs> I got to get the channel happening, guys. By the way, guys, $25 to join my Facebook group. PayPal me $25, ArchieLuxury72 at Gmail. I'm going to be setting that up. I'm going to be at you. And you need to tell me your WhatsApp name because I'll add you to the group. That is, um, that's the way to go. So, man, I got to tell you, man, I got to tell you, it's very, very hard. Life is difficult. And we've got another super chat here. Super fucking chats. They're coming in fast and furious. Blue shirt Buddha. Hashtag free Ui. Yes, indeed. I love Ui. Uh, Tommy D, $10. My sexican re sexy Republican auntie finds the pontiff very attractive. I showed her one of my top five Archie vids. Do I start a family or buy a luxury timepiece? What are your favorite vids of yours? Look, I tell you what, seriously. There is some very good, good vids there. I did a few, uh, but unfortunately, because of the way Google YouTube has changed things, I talked about having a sandwich in Bangkok. A sandwich. I talked about saving the historically significant uh, Nana Hotel, heritage listing the Nana Hotel. I also spoke about Four Floors the Whores. Yes, Four Floors of Whores. That was an amazing video. That footage was amazing. Did you see those jugs? They were very good. So I got to tell you, man, that's the way it goes. Um, look, look, I'm trying my best to get the punters on the channel. Uh I, I got to tell you, man, it's it's everything is very it's it's difficult. Everything is difficult in this world here. It is difficult. It is hard. There's nothing you can really say. This is how it is. This is it. This is it. I'm just going to turn the aircon on. It's very hot. Very hot today in Australia. And I gotta tell you, man, it's Scotch Day. I gotta have a Scotch. I'm gonna have a Scotch. I've been holding out for this alcohol all week. Uh, actually, I had some. Must confess, I did have some wine the other day because someone sent me a bottle of wine, and I was feeling a bit lucky. Uh, it didn't work off. I mean, I mean, yeah, I gotta finish it off. I'll finish the wine off tonight. It was a Espano Capo Vigilgo. Capo Capo Vigio Ligiaro. Temporalino. Temporalino. Spano. Spano. Uh, yeah, so there's that there. What else can I tell you, man? It's Fucktus Fucti. From the Latin to be totally, absolutely fucked. That's the way it goes, man. Um, it's it's hard. It's very hard. I got to be honest with you, man. It is the world is a tough place. It's not easy. It's vicious. It's difficult. 
I got to tell you, man, it is really fucking difficult. It's difficult. It's 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 hard, man. I got to tell you, man, it's fucking hard. Whist, whist, whist watch. Check. Yankee Doodle. I'm wearing a 5196. I actually made the repayments. I've made a repayment uh, on this. Uh and I got to tell you what, after I'm a little bit further into the payment process, we might get the seller on the channel. We might get him on there, talk to him. Uh, NATO, $2. Drink up, big boy. Yes, sir. I am definitely looking forward to a nice scotch. Anyhow, what I want to say is this. Blue shirt, put a two bucks. Where are the Cardinals and Treacherous Stakes? Hey, man, I'm sending the fucking links in the background. I'm trying to get these. Fuck is on the channel. Uh, I gotta tell you, what happens when you die? I mean, all the shit in your life. Okay, let's look at it. Right, like I, I've got stationery, buckets of stationery. Uh, I got my fridge, my old fuck, fuck. I got my old fridge. Okay, the fridge refrigerator. It's got water bottles in it. I got fridge, my fridge with the freezer, us fr frosting up compartment, you know. Uh, all this shit, when you die, is worthless. It's absolutely worthless. I mean, what are you going to do with all this shit? Look, books, look at the stuff here. Someone's going to come in. They're going to bring in a, a skip, an industrial bin, and most of it's going to end up, most of it's going to end up, in the trash, in the trash. So I, what I want to say to you is, man, you know, I'm actually thinking about minimizing, minimize, like minimalistic. I want to have quality watches. I'll have my paddock shrine. I'm thinking about becoming a minimalist because I got stuff here. I got foam. I got, I got packing foam here, all stacked away nicely and neatly. What do I do? What do I do, man? It's very tough. So what I'm going to have today, what do I feel like? Uh, I tell you what, I'm going to have a Deanston. A Deanston. I'm going to have a Deanston. I'm going to have a Deanston. There we go. I'm going to have a Deanston. There we go. Highland single malt whiskey. Scotch whiskey. There we go. There we go. Single malt Highland. That's hello, Clivers. Where the fuck are these guys gone? They just deserted me. They left me to suffer. It's tough. It's mean. It's vicious. Yankee Doodle is Mont Blanc. Is a Mont Blanc pen too cliche? Look, I do have a Mont Blanc. What you want to do is you want to have a Mont Blanc that is no longer available. See this Burgundy? That's no longer available. You want a Mont Blanc from the 90s. Uh, it is very cliche. I actually don't find the fountain pens to be very good. I prefer my Parker Dua Fold. The Cartier fountain pen is beautiful. Um, I got to be completely honest with you there, guys. Mont Blanc, I think they've become far too commercial. Um yeah, I think I think honestly, Montegrappa, they just it's like it's like Ray Ban. Every hipster pretend wanna be hipster wears Ray Band. You know, it, it was cool 30 years ago. It's not necessarily cool now. It's a bit like how Rolex has become. Okay, thoughts on the fifty thousand fifty thousand K. Brumont Rolling Stone piece. Fuck, were they were they going to launch that? Would, I can't believe that. Would they would they be that that silly to do that? I I I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I do not know that. I do not know. Would they do that? I have no idea. Would they do that? I, I I'm not sure. Would they? Um. I'm not sure, guys. I'm not sure. Would they do that? <laughs> That's a, a tricky, tricky, tricky sort of tricky thing. Um, 
I got to be honest with you. It's uh, it is difficult. Everything is difficult, man. Everything is difficult. Um, hello, hello, Clivers. Do we have any? No, we don't have any fucking. Where are these treacherous snakes gone? They're really nasty. Uh, doesn't work. Drinks expensive. Scotch goes on vacation twice a month and one hundred and fifty thousand of watches and you fall send. I don't understand, Ed. Ed, you're going to get banned if you keep that up, man. I tell you now, man. That's just a you've got a you've got what you call a bad fucking attitude. I'm going to put you in timeout for being a cunt. Uh, I mean, you, you just don't, don't say that, man. It just doesn't. You, I, I'm the pontiff, okay? I'm the fucking pontiff, okay? You don't say disrespectful things. Have you ever had a Kawika lily put? I'd never fuck it. What the fuck is a? I don't even understand what this shit is, to be honest with you, okay? I don't understand this stuff. Please explain. Please explain. That's what I would like to know. Um, I, 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 uh, what is this fucking thing? It's, it's weird. Okie dokie. Let's, let's, let's talk whist wist watches i'm worried when i die lonely old man mm. ah that felt good that felt really fucking good that felt absolutely amazing it felt absolutely amazing that whiskey felt amazing um it it really did it really felt amazing um i gotta tell you man i gotta tell you gotta 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 tell you i've got to tell you man gotta 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 i gotta tell you man gotta 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 i'm just sending all the invites out now get your fucking asses on here now guys i'm sinking fast sinking fast rich buddy i send them all out here we go okay done that's gone now that all the invites have gone. Uh, the Brumont, 50,000. What the fuck is that? What the fuck? 50K. What the fuck is this? Uh, the Brumont. Where the fuck is this thing? Uh, I can't find it. What the fuck are you talking about? What's this Brumont you're talking about? Brumont, 50, Rolling Stone, 50K Rolling Stones. Rolling Stones. Let's have a look, man. Uh, what's this? Brumont Rolling Stone guitarist Ronnie Wood. What the fuck is this bullshit? What is this fucking bullshit? I've just gone to a blog to watch. Brumont Rolling Stone. Brumont Rolling Stone. Fuck, that's an interesting take on it fuck what is it looks what is that i don't um yeah how much are these fucking things um it's yeah look i don't i don't hey that's kind of cool uh oh, 50 fucking thousand the 1947 collection of natural extensions 50 fucking thousand my god have these guys got rocks in their fucking head hello guys hello sir uh, Can you hear is, me? That, is that ron yes sir ron, ron the shrink is here what do you think someone's asked me about this new Brumont? I'm going to bring it up. I never even fucking heard of this fucking thing before. My oh, good I friend. Think at a, I think it's a great. I think, I think you should sell three of your protects and buy one. No, but look, I actually liked it. I came to it. Brumont Rolling Stones guitarist, Ronnie Wood. Ronnie Wood. Um, it's Ronnie Wood was my nickname in college. Okay. Look, I actually like it. I like the... It's the sort of shit I could do in math class. I used to draw shit, you know. Okay, I, I kind of like the style of it. Okay, yeah, it's cool. 
since 2002, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So, so Ronnie Wood is the guitarist. Who is – that's him there, is it? He looks a bit old. Well, he was in the Rolling Stones, so. Okay, so 1947, that's where probably when he was born, is named to commence Woody, Wood's birthday and is limited to 47 pieces. Each is bespoke – each features a completely bespoke, one-of-a-kind dial design. These hand-painted... Who painted them? Did he paint the fucking things? I hope he did. Well, uh, if you if you buy it, you get to be part of an exclusive club. I feel like painting. Okay, that's cool. Um, hasn't she got good knockers there? Just looking at 1942 retro classics. It's, a, it's clickbait, clickbait. Look at that. Um, okay, so how much are these fucking things? You know how much they are? Fifty fucking thousand dollars. Well, like I said, you should stuff, sell they? three packs and buy one. So how many? Two. I could sell two and get one. Okay, then do oh, this that. is US dollars. Is that what you're saying? US dollars, is it? Well, yeah. Oh, it's, it's vanished. What happened to this page? Why did it vanish? They sold out. Fuck me, dead. I mean, I, 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 I've seen fucking... I, I could not make this shit up, guys. I could not make this shit up. I mean... I kind of like it. Yeah, it's hip. It's happening. I could not I'm make this shit up. I'm just wondering where the Jewish cardinal's been. Exactly. Exactly. That's exactly it, guys. I'm going to stop the screen share. Doc's on. Hello, Doc BBW. How are you, Doc? I'm good. How are you? How are you guys? We had a relapse. I'm good, okay? man. We had a relapse, okay? <laughs> we had a relapse. I've sent you, okay, so anyhow, you've seen some of the dating, experts, ex, you're in a secret, you guys are in the secret Facebook group. I share some of my inner feelings and emotional things, which I don't normally present to the public. For 25 US dollars, you can join the Archie Luxury private Facebook group. 25 US dollars. Anyone who paid yesterday, it's being put through today. So just calm down. Um, guys, you know some of the, the dates there. Did you see some of the dates? Some of these nasty bitches? Did you see them or not? I think I saw one. I did not. Okay, so... Was she a little bit round? Was she rather round? I said to one girl, Hello, beautiful girl. How are you going? Are you still single? I was chatting to her about three years ago. I'd love to date you, but I would always be your lowest priority. Just under cleaning the oven and airing your mattress. Airing your mattress. Is that a euphemism for something? And there's another girl on the uh, the Badu. And she, I said, I hope you get someone who suits your needs. I said, I want a lover, not a wife. I know that. That is why I hope you can find someone who suits your needs. How about you? Will you be my mistress? I don't think so. Thank you. You saw that one. <laughs> Boy, you really go right in there, man. You, you, there's no mincing words. Okay, okay. Well, I'll, let me read you the secret bit. Just... Just been on the nose. Up. Okay, so I said to her, if you change your mind, you always got to come back for the kicker. If you change your mind, I love to kiss pussy. Ah. <laughs> that was that. <laughs> I'm trying to rope the charmer. Even, and then I had another girl, a Chinese prostitute I saw about three years ago. <clears throat> she says, darling, like a shinsi, you have a good time. What the fuck is a shinsi? I never heard that term. I told you what it was. I know. I didn't like that. So I just it? thought she so was tight. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is that term? <laughs> it, uh... <laughs> sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, Urban Dictionary. Check it out. How do you spell it? 
S H I N S H I. It's in the WhatsApp, man. We well, Jesus, about it in the what is it, you prudes? I don't know what that is. Someone just okay, say you it. put your dick into her ear canal. All right, that wasn't so hard, was it? Technically, <laughs> it's... Well, if you're going to get her in your ear canal, I don't think it could be. Could it fit? Does it fit there? I've never heard of this. I guess it Technic depends, Arch. Technically, it's... How uh, it's the you're you're sticking it in the partner's ear canal, so technically it doesn't necessarily have to be a woman. Technically, it could be a man in a dress, an Asian man in a dress. I can see the eroticism by putting your dick into someone's ear. Sorry, guys, I know I'm simple. I I'd know I went to Oxley State High, but how does that arouse someone sticking their dick into someone's ear? I think it's a test of. <laughs> It's a test. It, you know, there are different places you can stick it, and if you choose the ear, it says something about hey, it. Hey, do you want to hear a medical horror story? Besides yes. that? <laughs> do you want to hear a medical horror story? Go. Yes. Okay. Okay. So a good friend of mine, Brian – actually, we won't mention his name. Okay, sorry. His sister <laughs> is a virgin. <laughs> Brian, we're so sorry we mentioned okay. it. Okay. His sister's a surgeon. And they had this patient who had a, a thing called a stemper. It's where you, it was in her stomach where she had something cut out and they had a wound, right? A dressing there, right? And it never seemed to heal. Uh, we call it a fistula here. Oh, I don't know where this is going. Okay. okay. Oh, no. So, oh, no. So, Get out of here. Yeah. Yeah, that's no. exactly where he was sticking it. The husband was what the it. fuck? Because I don't, I, I, I don't understand. Actually, what you meant to say, Ron, is what do I fuck? Because uh, clearly, Ugh, he was a little confused. Wait, where was the fistula though? Was it? It's in his stomach. Stomach. It's, it's a, stomach. it's a stomach. It's a little oh. high. It's high on the outside. Ball two. Holy shit, boy! Hydrochloric <laughs> acid right up the dick. Does not sound fun. <laughs> so, anyhow, people, I'm just telling people do you amazing story. things. People, That's bullshit. I don't believe that. People do amazing <clears throat> things. Their fetishes, whatever you could think of, there's a sexual fetish for it. Well, you know, there's fetishes for women with uh, amputations. So, I mean, yes. This, yes, uh, yes, yes. So, this fistula thing, that's like, you're, you're amateur. Get out of here. That's nothing. That's nothing. Exactly. Nothing wrong with that, man. That's not. That's, you're just a beginner if you're doing that. But I got to tell you guys, I saw this thing on Japan where these old guys they die in there. You know how they could tell someone was poor if money was tight. You know how they could tell because when they went to clean the refrigerator, it only had water in it because the person only buys food for that day. Okay. Yeah, that's yeah. on an up on an upswing on a on a on, a on an upswing. On an upswing, bleach gets rid of most things on the floor. You know, the body is made of 80% water, so when you do depart, depart, get rid of most things, it actually leaves a very big stain. You, 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 you know this, Doc, don't you, or not? Uh, the bodily fluids tend to leave the stain, uh, but it's not so much the water as the stuff in it. I got to tell you, I'm very scared of dying. In Australia, we get ripped off at our funeral homes. Our funeral homes put medical waste into the coffin. I'm afraid of bodily fluids. That's why I'm a chiropractor. I really just don't like that bodily fluid stuff. And I got to tell you, man, it's just very nasty. The whole world is very fucking nasty indeed. Um, I was doing an adjustment on someone and they threw up. Is that a problem? Was for Ooh, me. I don't like have, what sort of adjustment, you know. Basically, it's a little <laughs> massage, but we call it an adjustment so we can get a little more money. I gotta yeah, tell, I'll you, tell you what, in medical school, the uh, the bodily fluids don't do it for me, it's the it's the cadaver stuff drove me crazy. I couldn't go to anatomy lab. Oh, formaldehyde, That's yeah, the it smell drove me, it, and it stays in your nostrils for hours, like you could taste it at dinner. I couldn't go. I just watched. I don't it understand this formaldehyde. You know, when you store shit in formaldehyde, it still seems to go funny. It's not really that good a preservative, is it? Uh, oh yeah, it's not great. Not not haha -ha funny, but 
No, it's great. I mean, it, it prevents bacterial, you know, decomposition. It, it's not perfect, but it's it, it, yeah. I mean, it's you can you can have stuff oh, in from I'm so Sorry. If you have an open casket, what what they do is they embalm you. Where what they do is they plug. What they do is they plug a tube into one of your veins. And they drain you like a vampire. Yeah, they, they flush out the blood and put embalming fluid in you to keep you preserved. Hmm. Anyway, on the Archie Luxury Channel, uh, <laughs> discuss well, you know, arches and fistulas. Yeah. All right. <laughs> the fistula thing was a much lighter thing to talk about, it's and I can actually lighter. understand that. Because when it's dark, and if you're an old guy and it's oh, dark, I mean, chat. thank you know. God, there's a super chat. Super chat. <laughs> Tommy D. Doc, I have an L6. How common is this? Apparently, Beyonce has one too. Uh, I know about a G6. Um, one day I'm hoping to have one, but you know, that's like millions of dollars, but, uh, L6, uh, I know I know an L6. L6. Oh, I see. Meaning it's a six lumbar an, an vertebra. An extra, extra yeah. vertebra. Yeah. Usually the, you know, most of the time it turns out that that's just a, uh, uh, congenital malformation and it's not really, you know. It's just like because your because your sacrals your sacrals are supposed to fuse, but anyway, Ron, you might know more about that, right? <laughs> I I've never heard of it. I've never heard of an L six before. Usually, what happens if the sacral if the if the sacral bodies don't fuse completely, it ends up looking like a false vertebra. And, and oh, I've never that's, heard of that's, that. And then that's a, that can be like an L six. It's really just part of your S. It's look. It's basically your S one is detached from the rest of the sacrum. Oh, okay. Right. I had a fight with my father yesterday. I rang him right, and I could tell he was in a poker machine parlor. Wow. And I said, you, you mean Don't a casino? Bet. No, a poker machine at Naira Cell Club. Oh. And I said, please don't spend my inheritance. <laughs> so. So, so naturally, that's that's a nice incentive exactly. way of getting them to spend all of it. Please, please, and uh, you know, I've got a. I'm having. I'm going to see him today. I'm going to tell him I'm sorry. I'm. I'm not. I'm going to miss the deadline for the repayment. I'm going to pay whoa, it back. Whoa, 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 whoa! Please tell me you're filming it for Patreon viewers. I will be. I will be trying to film it for Patreon. I will that's be amazing. recording it. Okay. Does your old man have it's... watches? Sorry. Does your old man have watches? Actually, he has a Rolex. I owed him some money a few years ago, and he said, hey, I'll take that watch that's on your wrist, which was a Rolex date just 16234. Hmm. Is that all he has? That's a, yeah. that's a Godfather move right there. Uh, it was okay. I owed him a couple thousand and got rid of the debt. It was it was cool. It Speaking was of very... the Godfather, I saw The Irishman. It was fucking awesome. Was it? The Irishman with De Niro and Pesci and uh, who else is in that? Um, have you seen that movie Ford versus Ferrari? I have not seen that, no. Okay. Is it about the GT, uh, the GT40? Yeah, GT40. That sounds like a great movie. Does your father still, does Papa Pluto still have the Rolex? Yes, he does, but he does all sorts of shit. He cleans the pool with it on, mows the grass. He never takes it off, and this is someone who wants to get a day date. I said, you will fucking kill it. I said, if you treat it like you treat your date just, it will fucking die. He needs, are, a, he needs a steel sub if he's going to do all that. You know what? My old man in the 90s had an Air King, 34 mil Air King. Oh, fuck. Is that he right? He never took it off. Yeah, it was, it was beautiful. That's the first watch I fell in love with. But um, he never took it off. He showered with it for years and never a problem. So... Has he, know, those, has he still got it? Has he still got it? He got rid of it, actually. What? He, got, he got rid of it? He, well, it's. I think he got rid of it when the economy went to shit. But he has a, a, an old Rolex date now. Um, it's re, It was uh, like redial and shit, but um, nice Rolex date. That's a little disappointing, though. That could have been cool as an heirloom for you to have. Yeah, I yeah. know. Super chat. 
What went wrong? I can't believe this super shit. I gotta say on that last super chat. Super too, chat. I'm Roland. not a big fan of Roland. Beyonce. There you go, Yankee Doodle. You can always repay him with your fishy pussy. Hello. There you go. Hey, Archie. And can I please uh, apologize? Can I make a confession on air? Well, yeah. why don't you confess to reading the super chat that Tanzil just sent? Okay, here we go. Tanzil, five dollars. Five dollars. Archie, a lady once described you as being like a shinshi. What the fuck is a finch shinshi? That's Doc the dick in the ear. Knows. Yes. Uh, we don't want to talk about how I know. Just I know. Okay. Yes, yes. So Thomas Wood five dollars. Archie, would you consider trading one of your Calatravas for a top notch Brigade Classic? No fucking way in the world. I'm paddock and pussy. The meaning of life is paddock and pussy. Paddock and pussy, paddock and pussy. I am in love with the I'm in love with the Brigade Marine man on the rubber. Oh, that is a cool watch. I'm that in is fucking very... love with that watch. And you know what I love about the Breguet Marine? It's not the Type 20. The Type 20 is kind of the poor man's Breguet, whereas the Marine is a proper Breguet. You know what I mean? The new Marine, I saw, uh, it's beautiful. The quality is amazing. But you can't buy this shit new. you got to buy this <laughs> used. It's like... No, you know what, though? I could trade my 14060 no. for a no! Breguet Marine. No! I know. No, I was no. tempted to, though. It's a beautiful watch. I've considered getting them on I've got a confession to make. Can I make a confession? Yeah, let's hear it. Does it have anything to do with shoes? <laughs> no. I, 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 okay, I got some gifts for, for Clive. I didn't have the money to post it last week. I lied to you, Clive. <laughs> I oh, you lied to me. Yet. What a shocking surprise. Oh. I tell you the, honestly, the, I am going, I've got money now. I'm going down the mail. to the post office on Monday. I will send you. I'll send it registered, and I'm also going to include an an Oris stick pin for you, like a rotor, a rooted rotor stick pin. Okay, to make checks in the this. mail, Clive. Checks in the mail. Everything is on its way. I'm going to. I'm going on Monday. You will get this. Okay, I will send it registered. You'll have it. No worries. So I just want to apologize. I was short of money. Okay, I was really short. The reason I didn't give you a tracking number is because I hadn't fucking sent it. Okay, uh, I apologize. Or not, I, I kind of figured that part out. Okay, but I'm gonna send it on Monday because I've given you. Did you get the mail? Did you get the book yet? No. No, I'll go check. I'll check. I'll check. Uh, here we go. Thomas Burdett. We done Thomas Burdett. Uh, I got to tell you there, man. Tanzil, Arch, what are the punters missing that you haven't joined the Archie Luxury WhatsApp group yet? What sandals have the Shinsi discuss himself discussed there? What scandals have the Shinsi? Shinsi? And I got to tell you too, Neo, five bucks. Hello, humanity. Shout out to Blue Shirt, the Tanzil, Mr. Burdett, the Thanksgiving Vulture. Thank you so much indeed. By the way, guys, if you've sent me money for to joining this group, you need to, you do need to have advised me what your WhatsApp username is because I want to add you. I want you to get the goss. There's goss. Man, you, you remember, do you enjoy being a member of this group? Tell me this. Tell me truthfully. It, it'll, I'll tell you this much. You'll get about 200 notifications a day on your phone. Are you, are you, are you a member, Victor? Yes, I am. I've I've talked to you on it multiple times, Archie. No, this is the secret group. You're in the yeah, secret group. Yeah, I'm in it with Doc, with with Yisham, with uh, yeah, I, I, Yisham, added with Mark. I added all the people. Yeah, you like being a member, don't you? I do like being a member, but I I could I could do without the 200 notifications. Although that's probably my fault. But the way I could probably figure out how to mute them. Okay, man, because I'm, I'm just I'm just making sure you like being a member. That's all, you know? Yeah, but you don't participate very often. <laughs> I do. I send pics. I send pics. I sent you my pickup lines and everything. You got trades. That, that, that was today. And then the last one was... Uh, Thanks to pick? Archie. Now you know where Shinsi is. That's true. And your pickup lines with the with the women and your, uh, your, your list of debts. And... Um, that's about it. Some weird articles. Normally, like, weird articles. What about that guy from Hong Kong who keeps posting girls he's banged? Fuck me, Dad. That's worth being a member. 
I got to change my Wi-Fi connection, gentlemen, but hopefully I'll rejoin you. Okay. Did you see that group of girls that he's uh, banged? Did you see that super chat that... Uh... Here we go. Super chats. I love the super chats. I live for super chats. This is from Neo. This is the one from Neo. Neo, I love you. Neo, love you. Long time. $5 to all the people who have sent me money. Suckers, suckers, suckers. No, that's not true, Neo. They are very cool punters. That's what they are. They are very cool punters. The the WhatsApp group is called the Archie Luxury Watch Group. Are you also going to read uh, Tanzeal's uh, Super Chat? And Tanzeal is very cool. I love the Tanzeal. Uh, AC3, I think Victor is confusing the M7 with the exclusive Archie Luxury WhatsApp group. Join now if you want to chat with Shinsi himself. Thank you. Uh, maybe, uh, yeah, I'm confusing. Yeah, it's the M7 group. And then Ray Pew. Oh my God, I just figured that name out. Here we go. Ray Pew, here we go. <laughs> Your dad sounds like my bookie. AC3, start selling used Mercedes instead of watches. Yes, I will. I, I actually do want to sell cars. I, You know, years ago, I went to the Magic Mile and said, can I please sell cars? They wouldn't let me in. They fucking, <laughs> fucking cunts. You know this? They were fucking cunts. Um, I don't know. I'm just going through my... I'm going to add Alan. He, he's a cool guy. Uh, they, I'll add those two guys. They're cool. Um, Keep you mean talking. Add David, you mean add David Breen to it? He, uh, I can't even remember, to be honest with you. Okay. Oh, yeah, here I'll, we go. I'll just add him. Super chats. I love you, Clive. You know this, don't you? Uh, you love super chats more. Why don't you try reading them? Okay, <laughs> Yankee. Uh, Two dollars at Neo. Thank you very much. Well, hopefully, hopefully here in the next, well, hopefully early next week. Speaking about straps, I haven't received. I'll finally be getting one mine from. Bear uh, Clooney's a member, by the way. Bear Clooney's a member. Oh, also, there's a new super. I don't know why he doesn't like fucking Mark. Mark's a cool guy. I love Mark. We're not going to go into that. Um, Although, I super chats, super chats, super chats. See, they don't come up straight away for me. It takes a couple seconds. See, boom, 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 boom. boom I didn't go to Oxley State. Here we go. Here we. Go, man. We got Neo. Five bucks. In all honesty, I really miss crappy luxury. No, we don't. He's a cunt. And my cunt, speaking of cunts, my cunt, shout out to Ray Pew. Ray Pew. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like Mike Hunt and Ray Pew and Hugh Janus are all the same person. Okay, as long as they super chat, who gives a fuck? Who really cares? I'm just adding members now to this group. Um, okay, I, no, actually, I'm also thinking about calling a, a group the ex, the former girlfriends of Archie Luxury Group. Is that a rude group to belong to? Well, I damn sure ain't gonna join it. No. No. By the way, I'm waiting on the strap from uh, Combat Straps, Aaron, to send it in. What does he say? He's a cool guy, isn't he? Uh, yeah, he's, it's going to be just, it's going to be uh, embossed distressed leather with that. Yeah, I'll in the same trailer park. <laughs> what? He paid you, comment. I didn't hear you. I seriously did not hear what you said. Oh, Ray Pew, because I said they're the same person, and he said we all live at the same trailer park. Oh, I nice. Anyway, like I said, I'm, I'm embossed uh, distressed leather and uh, with the patina stitching. I think it's going to look really nice. You can see, this, you know, Scottish watches, they're promoting that dog shit brand, ERG. You've seen that lately? No. Um, I, I, however, I do see a super chat from Tanzil. I'm sorry. Tanzil gave you so much money yesterday, Archie. You know that? I you love Tanzil. Tanzil. <laughs> Tanzil is the man. Five dollars, Archie. If you were to give it to Creamy T in the form of a Panerai dial, would it be a sausage or a sandwich? It'd be a sandwich. 
He probably gave you a hundred bucks yesterday. Biggest regret of my life is she promised to pay certain bills with certain services, and I said no. I'm a fucking idiot. You know this? I am a fucking idiot. There we go. I added 14 participants to the Archie Luxury Facebook group. We this, this so it's not a Facebook group. This is a fucking WhatsApp group. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hi guys. Hello, beautiful guys. Oh, this is the official Archie Luxury WhatsApp group. Post porn and watches. I got to tell you, Clive, is what's going on with you, man? Tell me what's happening with you, Clive. Oh, I just told you. I'm waiting for the uh, Aaron to send me the uh, new uh, new shoes for my Breitling. It's going to be Ooh, embossed what distressed. Did you get? What did you get, Clive? Distressed embossed leather with patina stitching. It should match the, uh, it should match the <clears throat> loom on the Panerai. Oh, it should match the loom on the pan. I mean, I'm sorry, on the, uh, my bad, uh, Brightling, on the Brightling. Pansil just uh, got a Panerai. That's what I was looking at a picture of it just now. I got to tell you, man, um, I I wanted to ask you, do you ever get absolutely shitted off with the fact that your watches that you've owned are absolute, you know, they're just absolute... Stinkers, Clive. No. No? Yeah. yeah. Watches. Because I can tell my watches apart. Oh, I see. Okay. But I'm on. That's beautiful, Clive. Tell me this, Clive. What are you buying next? I don't really think I'm getting anything. How did the cash flow go now that you've bought the Brightling? Uh, it's all right. Remember, <laughs> by the way. Uh, hey, five dollars from Can Seal. Five bucks. AC three. Will the pundits see the bitches you've been with in the <laughs> AC three group app? Who also have distressed patina C section stitching? Oh. Very, very cool. I got to tell you, man, they are some beautiful. I tell you honestly, man. I am honestly. I've honestly had enough in life, okay? I've really had a fuck time. I've had enough, okay? What do you mean? Clay, by the way, I've just uploaded a video which has got your opinion on the Rolex bubble, okay? Thanks. Can I, now that I'm completely drunk, can I ask you guys a serious question? <laughs> Wait a minute! I've just I've got WhatsApp open, and someone's on the Archie on the Archie group saying, "Who is this?" Evidently, it's my good friend Stephen Brooks. Um, I got to tell you guys, do you think do you think um, Paul Thorpe is a bit dodgy? He's connected to the K brothers, the Cray brothers, the Cray brothers. I mean, they were dodgy villains. Who are the Cray? Um, they were gangsters in London who went to prison for a long fucking time. They were nasty fucking cunts. What's your opinion, Clive? Well, just because, um, because not necessarily, not necessarily. Okay. I, mean, I like the guy. I like him. Yeah. Also, he has excellent hair. Also, unlike other people on this channel or some other people, or sorry, one other person on this channel, He's keep he's keeping his hair. Okay, David Coffee, two dollars. Arch, is it time for a cocktail? You fucking betcha. I, but this show is sinking like diarrhea. <laughs> um. I'm yeah. thinking about getting more footage for the um the channel when I'm in singers. Should I go to Four Floors again? Four Floors a horse again. Get some coverage. Absolutely. Okay. You really should you really? I would love to see the conversation between you and your father. Oh yeah. I really do hope that you film it, Arch. 
about the money I owe him. Well, telling him you're not going to pay him back. No, I'm going to pay him back. It's just going to be a little bit delayed. Oh, okay? yeah, no, 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 yeah. I, I would love to see that. I'm going to offer him two points a month. Oh, wow. Is he Jewish? What do you think? Is that okay or not? Uh, yes. Yeah. I mean, he's your dad. He shouldn't accept that. Yeah, I'll pay him. No, no. Matter. Yeah, but he's his dad, which means he will accept it. Two points a month, okay? Uh, sure, why not? Offer him a paddock. Oh, yeah, that's true. And he can start mowing the lawn and it. Offer him the whole time. I love my paddocks. Paddock and pussy is the meaning of life. You know that? You have enough to give him one, though. He's your dad. You got to, you know, yeah, he'll, absolutely. He'll go back to you, I'm sure. Okay. And when he dies, he'll probably uh, give it to a child he really loves. Oh. Oh, he's nasty. Clive is nasty. Tell me this, Clive. Did you get any inheritance from your own parents? Um, no, because once dad died and mom uh, kind of lost her marbles, uh, it all went to the nursing home. You're joking, aren't you? No. When they sold the house? Yep. They sold the Buick? <clears throat> The Skylark, the what was it? It was this. It was a, not a Skylark. It was a fucking um, Riviera. What they had a Riviera. A '63 Buick. No, but that was that was gone like ten years before they died. They had a Riviera. Uh yeah. A '63 Riviera. A '63 Buick Riviera. That's correct. What about a Studebaker? They had a Studebaker? No, they looked, they want, well, actually, mom did when I was a kid, but they were looking for like a golden rock. They never could find one. Or at least find one. For, well, and, and also, who took all the money? The nursing home did. Nurse, okay, Neo, super chat. Did they have anything of value when they died? Like a paddock or stuff like that? You well, know? Hell no. No. Grand complication? Super chat. Super chat. Neo, we heard about your paddock. Tell us. Tell us when you actually got pussy. Is that pussy? Palsy? Pussy. We heard about your paddock. Tell us. Well, I gotta be honest with you. I'm a man who needs to pay for certain services. Okay, it doesn't come cheap. Unfortunately, with the high fat diet, Doc. 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 Doc's gone. Ron. Yes. Unfortunately, with the high fat diet in the Western world, portly men are no longer considered. For their sexual vigor. Also, I'm seeing three unread super chats. Okay, we're seeing some more. Here we go. We've got the uh, we've got some. Oh, this is fantastic. Stack them up. We're landing them like a plane. Rape you, rape you. Bring a train set and a doll when talking to Papa. Tell him that the squeamish almost happened. He should be cool to extend payment time. <laughs> And Thomas Burdett, ten dollars. Time for another drink, Arch. Have one on the punt. I think I think he's right. I fucking had enough. I have had enough. I got to be honest with you. Nobody fucking loves me. The women hate my. The women want Yankee, fuck. Yankee Doodle just also super chatted five bucks. He's a cool guy. He's a very cool guy. Yankee Doodle five bucks. Archie's dad is tighter than a camel's ass in the Sahara Desert. You ain't. Fucking wrong there. Let me tell you this. He is so mean. Doc. NATO. Doc, NATO. $3 super chat. Doc, I got to tell you, man. Archie, Are you scared the, of dying alone? Archie, if you read the super chats, you'd be able to pay your dad back. NATO just that one. NATO, $3. Vic, can you please talk to your dog in baby talk? Baby, baby, wee, wee, wee. I, baby. I, hear, I have a hat for him. It says naughty and, and nice. You can put it on him. Yeah, do that, man. I'm feeling sorry. Yeah, put the, put the hat on, please. Naughty and nice. Tanzil and sorry, super chat. Tanzil, five bucks. Which of the following what celebs would Clive airdrop into the AC3 What's on WhatsApp? Paul Plutothorpe, Rodent 2, Cleo Embryas, Large Puerto Rican. Hmm. Speechless. Uh, you know, actually, 
I probably could slip a couple of those. Um, I probably I probably put Ronan two on. Ronan two. I like Adrian. You know that he's yeah. cool. Tell me this, guys. What's the situation with your watch collecting? Doc, are you doing anything interesting? Tell me. What are you doing for Christmas, by the way? What are you doing, guys? Christmas. Go on, just I'm trying to get the past Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. I have a new shitter. Okay. Yeah, that's just... Great. Ron, I want to ask you seriously, Ron. Have you yes. have any of your patients had any problems with watches? Have you treated anyone with watch problems? No, I have not. Do any of your a, patients have nice watches, though? That's a good question. You know what? I've never seen a nice watch on a patient ever. Or even in the hospital. You don't see the docs with nice watches either. It's very weird. I'm the only one. Wow. I have a buddy who wears Cartier, but that's it. Wow. That's it. You think I should put? You think I should involuntarily add Hotsey to the group or not? No, 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 no. <laughs> come Here we go, Steve Camasso. If you could get a realistic job, what would you be? I've got to be honest with you. I would be unemployed. Thomas Burnett, five pounds. Archie, could you play us out with your clarinet from the like Tim from Caseback Watches plays the guitar? Does he play guitar? Tenzel. He plays guitar well, very well. No. Fuck. Fuck. Spanish guitar style. Tan Zeal, I always envisage Ron the Shrink to be an actual patient of a psychiatrist dressed as Ronald McDonald, who happens to also like Timex. Oh no! Got, okay, no. Here's one. He got me. Here's one from Neo. Here's one from Neo. I really want to hear. Super chat. Five dollars, Neo. Neo, Archie. For years, you we've heard how this December you are being evicted. No, no, it was the end December 2020. It's not this year, suckers. It's not this year. I always said it was 2020 December, not 2019. Where are you going to live? I got another year here. I'm moving into a trailer park. Are you really? He's We're thinking about a van park. down by the river. Uh, wait, are you really moving into a trailer park? From a trailer park. They can get hit by tornadoes pretty easily. <laughs> For... are, you, are you trying to say something? Are you trying to imply something? <laughs> I just asked him. I didn't say anything. How will you fit in the trailer? Uh, oh, I'm going to move in there shortly. They have actually really, really nice trailers. Like I've seen on like a YouTube channel. They yeah, the problem is the trailer park that I'm going to. Is that it's in summer, it's like an oven. In winter, it's like a fridge. You said you want to be a minimalist earlier on the channel. Why don't you move into one of those? Uh, what's it called? The small, the tiny homes. Uh, no. I love hey, tiny man. homes, don't you? Hey, Gates is saying he owns a rental on the Gold Coast. Who? Is it a standard trailer or a double wide? Standard. Who's got a rental at the Gold Coast? Who? Uh, Al Alvin Gates. Shinsi. How do you pronounce Shinsai? I don't know. Okay, ten zone. Sorry, five dollars Canadian. You can move. Hey, Art, you can move in with Clive. Uh, Fuck you. No, no. Atlanta's closer. It'd be cheaper air for better watch selection. Hey, Australia. No, it's, you have to go through California to get to the United States from Australia. So actually, Oklahoma's closer. Uh, no, he'll probably come in through the East Coast. I don't know. I think he's going to have to do a LAX, uh, LAX, California. LAX, LAX. Los Angeles. California, no, no, no. California is banning beef imports. It'll have to be the East Coast. <laughs> AC3, were the bushfires started by the amount of cash you were burning by? Five dress paddocks. I love my Patek Philly. Archibald, I want you to screen share and and look up my watch real quick. I want an honest assessment. Well, actually, before you do shit for free, which you don't do, there's two other super chats. The New Yorker, two bucks. Sad that AC is refusing to the 
48 hour live show. Yeah, why don't you do that? I, I will, will when I come back. Dave Coffee, $2. Arch, how do you pronounce Shinshi? I will contribute to that 48 hour show substantially if you do it. If you can make it all 48 hours without leaving that chair, I'll give you 150 bucks. I will try. Pull the stream from the toilet. Uh, we'll have to figure that out because I don't want it. nobody wants to see that. I'm allowed a toilet break, I think. Okay. Well, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll 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 create some rules, but you have to sleep in the chair, and you can't turn the camera off. Mm. Okay. So we'll see all the pillow biting and uh, and everything. That you know, you've made it. You know, you've made it when the toilet has a chain instead of a string. Yeah, super chat. Woody New Yorker refused to be part of the AC3 WhatsApp group. Yes, right. Woody left where Archie was promoted promoted by a large Asian female to the rank of Shinshi. Nice. Yes. Yankee Doodle. I'm just going to go and get some nuts. I'm well, going to have some you, nuts. Before you grab okay? some nuts, Yankee Doodle just sent a $5 super chat. Yankee Doodle, if you were offered a free trip to the moon, would you go? I'll lend you my speedy for the ride. Betcha. I love free trips. I'm going to go get some nuts. Okay, guys, do not super chat while he's off getting some nuts. You know, between me and you guys, I would have maybe invited people to the group after the show instead of being on the phone for the entire show. Pretty much. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> Emmy is saying it seems no money is buying the new 40 millimeter day date there in every ad. Okay, A, A Gates is saying let's talk about the rental he owns. Oh, it's a nice one. It's beautiful. He's pretty wealthy, I'd say. On paper, he is. Just when, uh, fuckers, fuckeroonies, fuckeroonies. Hi, guys. We're just talking about the rental you own. Hey, here we go. I just went and got some nuts. I'm just hungry today. I got macadamia. Macadamia. I'm under pressure. I got to see my old man about my loan. Oh, and what's going on, guys? And also, I'd like just to also point out that Archie is going to where are you going? Singers or bangers this time? Singers. He's going to singers because he accidentally double booked a hotel room. That's why he's going to singers. Uh -huh. You have to ask me about conspiracy theories about why he's actually going to singers. How long is a flight from um, Brisbane to singers? Also. Five dollars, five five dollars. Sorry, you're not going there, Arch, unless you have something uh, substantial happening. Long ass way. I know why he's going. I know. Ten cents. Sorry. Super chat. I think he fell asleep. <laughs> he wants me to to upload the picture of the Shinsi girl. Okay, I'll do that, okay? Also, George Gregorio. Hang on, I'm just doing I'm, it now, guys. Just hang I'm, on. I'm a little bit uh, disappointed in Tanzil. I'm surprised he didn't call it Master Shin Sing. That's coming. I also like pecans. Do you like pecans, guys? I do not. I do not. You don't like pecans. What's wrong with pecans? No, nah, it's got to go cashews, man. I prefer cashew. Yeah. I'm with you on that run. Cashew. What's got less fat in them? Uh, they're all horrible. Probably pecans have less favorite. fat, but they're all in high quantities. They're all horrible. George you know Gregorio. This? George Gregorio, Super Chat. Oh, Wiki Watch Leaks. Okay. I'm just waiting for it to come in. Can you read it for me? 
Archie, send the new soundboard to your all your Patreon. I will. I will. I will. Oh, sorry. I just accidentally posted it on the live stream. Okay, ignore that link I just posted, guys. Sorry. That's okay. Also, Wiki Watch Leaks. What is with all this crying on YouTube about nasty vicious comments from the watch community? That was you, Clive. You were whinging on your channel. No, just horology left because of trolls. What was I whinging about? What do you think of the community, Clive? You know, there's there's a bunch of really great people, and there's like, like a little core of diehard watch enthusiasts. They're like gypsies because they grow around from channel to channel, and they're consuming all the content they get their hands on. They're learning. And they're sharing. They're stealing? No. Uh, oh, by the way, Thomas Burnett. Super chat. Archie can get the nuts in your mouth and read the super chat. Thomas Burnett, five pounds. Big Saturday shout out to the number one Neo. Blue shirt Buddha, Rich Buddy, Turkey Vulture, NATO, Brummy Jack, Tanzeal, and Discount. I got to oh. be honest with you, this might jeopardize my privacy if I send this this email through. What do you think? Do you reckon it'd be, I mean, I, that was quite an erotic thing she said. She wanted me to stick my dick into her ear. I, I think it's something thought, to be proud of. I thought I she wanted to be proud of it. I thought she wanted to stick her dick into your ear. She said that I'm handsome like a shinsi. <laughs> what do New Yorker super chat $2? You wouldn't want to do anything to violate your, your modesty. Exactly. Just be, be proud. Here we go, guys. You can see that on the screen now. There we go. That's the girl who said, Darling, you're handsome like a shinsi. You have a good time. What the fuck is a shinsi? Okay, what do you New Yorker $2 super chat? <laughs> Archie. Yes, sir. Yes, what sir. You Two dollar super chat. Okay, here we go. Only Only left the group because my daughter daughter checks the phone. Oh wah 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 wah. Two dollar super chat from Car Fund. Here we go. Dollar super chat from Car Fun. What's nicer, a 2000 Jaguar XK8 or a 2000 SL500? Fuck. Uh, I'd go with the SL500. What's wrong with the Jag? Nothing. I just love an S Class. But it's the old <clears throat> year 2000. Yeah, that was so bad. I think that was the nice. I liked it. Let me look. That was, I liked the 2000. That was the W140 derivative, wasn't it? That was a classic. Style. Very classic. I liked it. Okay. $5 Super Chat Tanzone. Sorry. How come I don't see these? Yep, I stopped my my phone. The governor's <laughs> governor, Tanzil, five dollars. The governor's governor, the horological pontiff, the fucking shitters, Shinsi himself, Paul Pluto. And we're going to look at this car quickly. This is the Mercedes that Victor's talking about. That's fucking ugly, Victor. It's not. I mean, I remember when I was young, my uncle had that car. I thought it was the coolest thing. Your uncle had one. What did he do? What do you mean, like for work? Like, was he a pimp or what? No, they own an insurance company. Like, they're twins. One passed away. Yeah, uh, they own a travel agency and an insurance company. How and rich they're, are they? They're an expensive car. Yeah, they're no, uh, they were pretty well off. Okay, what in New York? What color? What color? What color? 
That was white. He yeah. has he has the new SL uh, sixty three AMG and an S. I believe uh, either an S five fifty. Um, so he has the convertible and the S class and the uh, the long body sedan now. Wow. The other okay. one passed away, but yeah. two dollars super chat with a New Yorker. AC, what's your view on the Tesla pickup truck? I got to tell you, the problem with Tesla is nobody can work on them. They are so expensive because it's high voltage. If you don't know what you're doing, you can electrocute yourself. Yeah, did you see the new pickup truck with the? It's very, very like uh, it looks like a concept car. You know, most repairs on any Tesla are three times more than a normal car. Okay, but I think you're asking about the design and stuff. Take a look at it. Google it. It's very interesting. I, I love it. I, I, a lot of people are, it's getting really positive reviews. I think it seems very, like, it doesn't look like a car. It looks like something like a concept car. I think I could get used to it. More super chats piling up. No, not that. None of these. It's the uh, right, it's the one on the top right picture. Look at the top right arch. It just looks like a Hilux. Look at the top right picture. Do you see it? Click yeah. On. Okay, got you. Yankee Doodle, two dollars. Does Mercedes still have the prestige? No, it doesn't. Mercedes has mass marketed itself. The A class, the fucking B class. Mercedes used to be luxury sedan maker. Now they're fucking everything to every cunt out there. I I tend to disagree. I like the new. I like the S class. I think they're they make a beautiful car. NATO, three dollars. How do I get on the WhatsApp group? You set PayPal me twenty five fucking dollars, and I'll add you. Then you email me your your address and I'll, uh, your your fucking your phone number, and I'll add you to the WhatsApp group. You also take a uh, a super chat, right? Yes, of course. Any forms of currency are accepted. Well, yeah, but if they but if you send a super chat, Google or. Uh, whatever the fuck this thing is, uh, YouTube will take 20%. That's okay. We don't mind. Okay. Woody New Yorker, $20. New, Woody New Yorker, $2. Own the Model 3 for over a year. No trouble, no cost. You bang it up and see what the fuck happens. They will rape you. They will well, tie you down. Sorry, $5. And they, will shinsi you. Yeah. they will shinsi you. They will shinsi you. I love the Tesla Model 3. Do you have the autopilot Woody New Yorker? I test drove that thing. I was in like, I I love that. Okay. Uh, $5, 10 selling star. You want to read that there, Horn Boy? If you want to be part of the Shinsi, Shinsi Sensation Nation, join the Archie Luxury WhatsApp watch group where Archie talks, takes confession for your shitters. All right, Arch, what watch are you wearing? Oh, we're in the paddock, fifty-one ninety-six. Okay. Okay, so that just took care of the next PayPal by uh, Thomas Burnett. Can we talk Can watches? We talk watches. There, yes, indeed there. there we go. Get back to watch talk, fuckers. All right, Arch, All right here, Arch, I have it. a question hey. for you, Archie. Okay, if what are your top three watches? If you could give him the money, let's say you sell two or three of your paddocks, which you could. Pick three watches to decide between. Yesterday you mentioned the fifty-one seventy. What other two watches would be on your list? And then I want you to answer the same Panda! question. Panda. 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 Okay. What else? Fifty-nine seventy. Okay. Yeah, that's a good choice. And what else? Not paddock. Well, you said Panda. What about not paddock, not Rolex? What watch would you have? I like that navy themes that Clive has got. That is a sexy watch. Yeah, I always liked fantastic. it. I always liked it. You know, oh, the I, I, didn't it's know I may not like you, but I like your watch. That might be Clive's best watch, in my opinion, of, of the stuff he's shown us. Are we Especially talking about the reissued, the new one? The navy themes. Mm. Yeah, that is stunning, man. On that might break. be my favorite offshore of is all time. Is that still available? I'm not sure, but yeah, I know. Offshore, I have not seen it. Yeah, I don't think it was very popular when it first came out. So, Steve, come off the two dollars. Another super chat for Clive has to tell Archie. 
Here, Arch, I got a new tutor. I want to, I want for 750 bucks, I want to show you this. Yes. Pull yes, it up yes. on the uh, screen share. Okay, wait. Five dollars super chat, Yankee Diddle. Can any of you think of a realistic watch trade you would do with the Pontiff? I'm about to get a Panda. You give me your world time. Actually, that would be a fair trade. Oh, that's nasty. Yep. Rolex. <laughs> Tan zone, sorry, five dollars. Art, you want to trade your world time for the black dial Daytona? Victor, why is everything always in your favor? I don't know that it is in my favor. They go for around 24, 20, 24, 25, and the world time goes for around 22. So it's actually in your favor. 10 zone, sorry, $5 Canadian. Archie. I don't think you can get up for 22, Victor. Archie. Hey, horn boy. And zeal. It tastes like chicken. Keep on licking. If it tastes like trout, get the fork out. Paddock and pussy. Okay. Is it is it racist to think that um, three out of five paddocks look alike? No, three out of his five paddocks look alike. Yeah, that's fair enough. You can you could. That's a fair comment. All right, so Arch, if you sold all your paddocks, you'd probably have what around a hundred grand. One watch yeah. for a hundred grand. Um, would that make me happy? I I didn't ask that. I asked which watch would you pick. We're talking just hypothetical. Five one seven zero P. I go platinum Daytona. You would get the. Well, he, he yeah, he could get a platinum Daytona and have money left over. Yeah, but he'd he have like thirty that. grand left over, right? Yeah, but five one seven P when you could do the five one seven O in gold and have fifty grand get another watch. You would really spend all that extra money just to get that watch in platinum. No, the platinum has a different dial you know, on it. Do. Though, platinum too. Daytona you and then get, get a sixteen fifty five man. That, those two, you could get a five two seven zero G for all your watches. You wouldn't that be something? Five two. Be amazing. That is the the granddaddy of them all. Yeah. Have any of you guys ever owned a uh, sixteen fifty five? I have. Have you? Really? I sold it for six grand. Oh my god! That's my favorite. I think that's my Grail piece. Is a sixteen fifty five? I bought it for three. You know that? I bought it for three, and I sold it to Alvin Lee in Singapore for six that same day. When did right, you buy right. it for three grand? 2001. Holy fuck. What's the most you ever made on a watch? It used to be a shark, okay? I used to advertise in the paper. De collector pays more than dealer. I knew all the tricks. Don't worry about it. That's why I've had 20 years of bad karma. Arch, what's the oh, most you ever made on a watch and the most you ever lost on a watch? Sorry? What's the most you ever made on a watch and what's the most you've ever lost on a watch? Ooh, <laughs> the most I've ever made. I tell you this now. The most I've ever lost... Uh, I remember bought this Datejust 1601 that had been converted into two-tone. Ooh. It had been tightened and redialed. I paid Ooh. 1800 for it. Fuck that, that. That was This was in the late 90s. I really did my ass on that. How much? Well, if you paid 1800 how much could you have actually lost? Not that much. Yeah, it was just... It was just just a lot of time went into it. Uh, what, how much? What's the most I've ever made? I, I bought a Prince for two hundred dollars and I sold it for six and a half thousand. Wow. Prince? No, no, a vintage, vintage yeah. Prince. Well, that's a that's that's very good. Yeah. How'd you get but it for two dollars? I used to I used to advertise. Collector pays more than dealer. I wasn't that honest, but okay. <laughs> It was a bad business, bad karma. I'm never going to do that again. I, I took advantage of people's lack of knowledge. Okay, I was dishonest. I was egotistical. I was a pretty awful person back then. Speaking of which, you know, you're speaking a great of, person now, Archie. Whoa, 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 whoa! Speaking of which, how are the paid watch reviews coming along? Uh, actually, they are coming. They're coming. They're not too bad. I've got to be honest with you. I was an awful person back then. I did a lot of things that I should never have done. Tell us three things you did that you shouldn't have done. 
whatever watch they had, it was always the wrong one. I'm so sorry. This is not the one that's wanted. <laughs> the worst thing I ever did is I had this, this old guy I bought a 5512 from for a two hundred dollars. Super cheap. <laughs> and I was angry because I thought it was a five five oh eight. I was angry <laughs> Super at it. Holy shit. Steve Tommaso, hi Art, what's your next Rolex purchase? Actually, I wouldn't mind getting a 39mm Explorer 1. The other horrible thing I did, I tell you this now, I remember I remember this guy sold me a watch for cheap, right? Yeah. And I had my son with me at the time, and I said, oh, will mummy let me use the shopping money to buy this watch? Super job. <laughs> Super okay. Chat. Okay. Here we go. Super chat. Ten zeal. Five bucks. Uh, do you think you would do better as a used watch salesperson in Florida or vice president of Patek over any large Puerto Rican? Very good indeed. I tell you this now. So anyhow, I said to this guy, I said, "Look, do you reckon Mummy will mind if I use grocery money to buy this watch?" So I bought the watch. <laughs> it was red sub for fifteen hundred dollars Australian. Holy a thousand. Shit. And then next couple of days later, he rang me back and said, oh, look, I felt so bad that you used your money. I'm gonna, I want to offer you your money back plus $300. And I said, look, you stupid fuck. That was, a, that was an act. I've already sold the fucking thing to a UK dealer for $5,000. Go fuck Holy yourself. Shit. You said that to him? Yeah, I did. I had, <laughs> I had big balls. Brass balls! Oh, my God. After he Holy called shit. you back and felt bad, you yep. pulled him the fuck off. Yeah, and I said, if you want it back, give me 6000 and you can you can suck my dick. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> you great. are. You're going to hell, Art. Um, Jay Paul. Here we go. $2 review. The 5905P-1001. Black dial, five nine zero five. The annual. Okay, dial. well, you have to give them two dollars worth of review. I gotta tell you, man, that would have to be one of the most beautiful. I, I, I gotta. Let's get this fucker up on the screen now. Let's get this baby on the screen. Screen share now, fucker Roonies. So, what does this fucking thing look like? Here we go, guys. This is what it looks like. And uh, I love the blue. The blue. Look at the, like the fucking blue thing there. But he wants the look, black. It's an black. annual calendar. It's an annual calendar. It's actually a big size. These are 42 mil, right? They're really modern size. They're almost a sports watch. They're so big. This is the platinum one. Platinum is about uh, seven, 60 grand. Hey, Archie, 60 grand. Archie. Super chat from Mike Hunt. Okay, I'll lick yours if you lick mine, Mike Cunt. Shout out to Bo Gunman and Jamie Way, $2. Laugh out loud. That was a great story. And I got to tell you, man, I got to tell you, got to, got to, got to tell you the 5205. I, I used to love the 5396 annual calendar. This is fucking better. Okay. They, they also do a version of this without the chronograph. That's that the 5205, isn't it? Isn't it? What's, what's the one without the chronograph? The 5205. You know, yeah. five. The 5205. Two, five, two, five. Five. Just an annual calendar. That's fucking yeah. 60 as well. I, I actually, I, I think the 5205 would be fine. Okay. Well, come on. It's an extra chronograph. That's a big deal. It, it, it's double the it's du double the price exactly you're right you're 100 right um uh, i'd love one but i can't i got no money i'm fucking broke you know how broke i am karma karma came your way unless you are fibbing us as well and the other thing i did was that was awful yep. what else i do i just you know um super chat speaking about taking advantage people five dollar super chat <laughs> thomas burdett five dollars archie would would what do you think of the iwc pilot range like the spitfire i love it but don't not for retail new. don't buy it new you gotta they buy it used they, they, they're actually i like the iwc a lot of their watches i like but the spitfire colors are fantastic Salita pisses me off. Salita, Salita. I actually, 
I really love the brand, but fuck, something about a Salita that really irritates me. Well, as long as you're paying for a Salita movement and you're not paying for Nate House. Anyhow, I got to tell you, man. What's the what's the other bad thing you did? All that money that I made from being a cunt, I spent it just as quickly and all went. None of it stayed, okay? Well, money you made. No, no, no. I lost it all. I bought a fucking Italian car, okay? <laughs> I spent it on whores. I spent it on whores, fancy cars, and the and the rest I wasted. How many STDs have you had to uh, deal with in your life total? Not many, actually. I always rubber up. You know that? Is that right? You got rubber four. up. And I always take a, a round of antibiotics whenever I come back. Wow. Well, not much means more than zero, but less than much. Oh. So what's not much? Oh. Crabs! <laughs> Yuck. Yeah, that's gross. <laughs> Yuck. <laughs> You've got carpet beetles and crabs. <laughs> Anyhow, <laughs> look. Victor, Victor, Victor. <laughs> this, this you, know, yeah, you wonder if they fight it out. <laughs> probably, probably they just floor it like the Battle of the Somme every day, you know? <laughs> i got to tell you, man. Victor, <laughs> yeah. don't do that are dishonest. Your money, you spend it. It's like you make money dishonestly. You spend it really, I, really. I fast. consider myself a very honest person. I don't. I. I cannot relate. <laughs> you I cannot not love an honest man. You know that you cannot cheat an honest man. You heard that's so true. You know, I've actually said to people, "You're selling it too cheap." I, I, I don't do that now. Okay. Well, you cheated that honest man. The one you said, "Go fuck yourself." You can buy it for six grand. Back. <laughs> That was 20 years ago, Victor. No, but you said you cannot cheat an honest man. You sure as hell can. Look, it's, 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 it's a very tricky thing, okay? I mean, I've got many problems in my life, and uh, i got to be honest with you. Fast money has never helped me much, okay? Fast money has always... It's always gone very quick. You know, the I, I like how you said I, I spent it on cars and whores and then I wasted the rest. <laughs> <laughs> Super yes. Super chat. John O, $2. Archie, sell your world time to buy Casio Oceanus. What the hell is a Casio Oceanus? <laughs> I never. Howdy from Texas says Doc's sister is watching this stream right now and bleaching her hands. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta be honest with you, we've all got confession time. We've all done things. I don't try I now I don't want to do anything to anyone. I'm very look, tell me this five dollars for entrance. Do you realize do you realize the reason Paul Thorpe was beat up was because he's a bit dodgy. He sold his son sold something to some cunt who no, his fucking. son was selling. His son was selling not just one time. It, it was I can't like, believe he's not involved in yeah, that. Yeah, but okay? on the other hand, between you, I cannot fucking believe Super he's chat. not involved in that. I mean, seriously, drive. I got to be honest with you, Yankee Doodle, two dollars predictions for Basil twenty twenty. Oh, okay. Let me start. It doesn't exist. No, let me start. Okay, I think this will be the most accurate prediction. Rolex will introduce new watches, and none of us will a be able to fucking buy them. I, uh, I'm gonna try my hard oh, for you, Victor. Sorry, <laughs> I got. I was the first one to get the Batman. I was happy about that, but I that didn't come easily. They fucked up my watch, and I got it as a um, consolation. Well, if you're lucky, if, if you're lucky, we'll fuck up more of your watches. That's true. That's another way to. That's another way to get watches from ads. If they do something wrong, you can hold them to it and say, "Listen, you gotta, you gotta give me something from the safe to make it right." Hey Archie, real quick question: When did the yes. horns? When did the horns really start to come in? Uh, it's normally about 40, 40, 40. It's like everything goes bad in your life, you know. I tell you seriously, I'm really scared of dying alone. 
in my own little studio flat. No, no one, just paddocks. That's it. No pussy. Paddocks and no pussy. That'll be the end. I'll Art, probably. You have, Art, you have the best life. You have the best job. You make great money. You have, you talk watches all day on YouTube. That is the dream life. Don't wish too hard. It can come true. Remember that. I would love to have be full time on YouTube. That would be a okay. Great Victor, do you have any stilettos in your house? Not that I put my balls in. <laughs> you don't get the right size. Tell them, Arch. It's got to be thirty-six and a half. Thirty-six and a yeah. half, man. That's Otherwise, the they'll fall off. It's not exactly right. right. It just protects it perfectly. Perfect. <laughs> Listen, Archibald, I'm going to be a cunt. I really want a free watch review. Can we? Can we pull up the the screen share here? Super chat. Super chat. God damn the super chats. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. I gotta tell you, man, it's all fucked. It's all fucked. The world is fucked. Yankee Doodle predictions for you. We already did that one. And Yankee Doodle, I wouldn't trust Paul Thorpe as far as I can spit. Yes. He looks like a I gotta soccer. Be honest with you, again. I, I, had, I had a friend of mine who reckons he got a dodgy dial from him. And and Paul, he doesn't use Thorpe as his last name. He uses Sutton. And it's right. the same address as his website. And this guy bought a dial from him. It was fake, and he he, he just he just acts like a real cunt. That's that's what I've heard. I, I don't know. I allegedly, you don't want to get sued, dude. Allegedly. Well, no, I'm no, just no, telling no. you. He's not saying allegedly. He's saying it actually happened. I know the guy. Okay? I know. Say, I know. The, I know the people. Say, I know. Say Paul Pluto saying that. I, I, know the, I know the guy. Okay, and and to be honest with you, it was pretty. To be honest with you, I think you know the margins in watches don't support Ferrari lifestyle. I can tell you that. Although I, know, I have to, I I wonder because there is a there is a dealership, a secondhand like a you know a gray market guy here. It's a standalone building. He drives a Ferrari, and I have to wonder, you know, like, but he never admits it's his, but we all know it's his. Uh, what, what model Ferrari? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. You know, you can always tell though uh, a watch dealer that's that's ethical and honest because they've always got a sign in their window. What does it say? Out of business. Yep. That's about right. Let me tell you that. That's about right, guys. I'm going to end the show now. This is an hour and a half. You guys have been troopers. It's been a great show. I will be doing a Wednesday, which is Tuesday night show for you Americans. And uh, this is before I leave. And uh, I got to tell you, man, I'm really looking forward to your Super Chat dollars, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm really looking forward to – I got to be honest, man – the world is fucked. Microsoft, you see that story I sent you there? They sued this guy who was a recycler for copyright. He or he was just copying a a a a, a boot, a sort of a uh, a restore disc, which you can download free. Yeah. The world is fucked. You know that the whole world that we live in There's is probably really more to it. The media tends to. Uh... It's a facialized news. Well, Microsoft, it, 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 it's a, he was he was downloading the Dell system restore disk, and it's it's actually if you look into it, he got done by like a dinner. The world is nasty. They don't want you to recycle. They don't want you to save things. They want well, you to just buy new. You have to be careful what you read. Remember the McDonald's? You know she got the woman who sued McDonald's got two million dollars for hot coffee. Sounds crazy, but there was actually, you know, reason behind it. it wasn't as crazy as it sounds the way the media made it out to be. So that's actually that's very true. They were intentionally keeping it way above. Yeah, there was the yeah. show and it was punitive damages and they had to give it to her because there was no one else to give it to. She just happened to be the best position. But the whole point was that it was punitive. They showed the records where they were they actually had like calculated risk. They said, OK, this many people will be in the ER, but we'll make this much money if we have hot coffee. They found these documents. They had to punish them. 
Right, because they, they were doing unlimited refills. Yeah. So if it's hot enough where you can't drink it, you can't, they, you, you'll you save money by not doing the refills. Exactly. Moreover, yeah, yeah. It's, hard, it's hot enough. It's not like an ouchie. It seriously can cause serious burns. Yeah, they were, yeah. Right. They, yep. And and the whole point was, you know, she got $2 million because it was punitive. It's not like she had $2 million in damages. Yeah. It just happened to be the judge. Who is the judge going to give the money to? They, You have to give someone with standing that money. So happened to be her. Okay, guys. See you very soon. I'm going to end the show, guys. That was a great.